today, Dr. Boyd and his medical staff remain personally committed to providing medically safe and emotionally supportive care, including medical abortions and surgical abortions in all trimesters. This is Susan. How may I help you? I needed to speak with someone about a later uh, pregnancy termination. Okay. And have you had an ultrasound done? Yes, I have. And, and did, did, did they give you a, either a BPD number or a due date or weeks and days? 33 weeks today. Is there anything wrong with the pregnancy? Yes. My baby has Down syndrome. Looks like we can see you. Okay, and then um, just on the procedure itself, like what are the main risks that I'd be looking at? That you would run if you went ahead and did a normal vaginal birth, um, carried the pregnancy to term and did a normal vaginal birth. Same, same as if you, if you decided to go ahead and keep this pregnancy and go ahead and go through labor and delivery with it, to have a live birth instead of a stillbirth, the risks are neck and neck. Dr. Boyd, how can I help you? Uh, hello. I wanted to request an appointment. Do you know how far along you are? I think I'm due on June 20th. So I think that puts me at like 32. Yeah. About um, 33 weeks. Do you have a history of C-section? This is my first pregnancy. And did they tell you if anything was wrong with the pregnancy? Well, no. No. Unfortunately, ma'am, I think you may be too far for us to see. I've been hearing people saying, oh, New Mexico is the place. You know, it's the place yeah. to go. I mean, and we, do. we do. We're one of three clinics in the nation that do their trimester terminations. But um, as the pregnancy grows, the risk begins to increase. You're very close to being full term. So what... I mean, what are the risks? I mean, you just... There's a higher chance of preeclampsia. There's a higher chance of um, bleeding. We are an outpatient clinic, so we're not in a hospital. Um, so the risks of complications can, can increase. I'm like, yeah. I'm like listening to you say about the risks, and I get that, but I'm like it's, it's healthy, you risk know. In, in delivery, because you're actually at higher risk um, delivering a full-term pregnancy. Well, you're nearly full term, and most deliveries happen nowadays. They're they're more labor deliveries are happening in a, in a hospital. Because I thought it was legal in New Mexico. Well, it's legal, but it's not a matter of the legality. It's a matter of how comfortable the doctor feels in performing this termination.